folks, I'm Dave, and welcome to the start of my Fates Grand Order Halloween event playthrough. But before we continue hence forth of some event viewing, I would like to share a wee story of mine which led to me actually being able to record this game once again. So, once upon a time, when I was having a wee snooze in my bed, Cuddling a pillow that looks oh so familiar to this foxy lass on screen, I had an epiphany. Tossed my bed sheets aside and fiddle faddled to follow some sayings on an application, and lo and behold, it actually worked! Which allows me to showcase this game again. But I also have no clue if that wee issue I originally had is going to rise up again, so. Whilst everything is in working order, I may as well try and enjoy my time with it. So, with that we sit but in mind, let us continue. Henceforth to my room to do some event viewing. Because I originally started up the event thinking I wouldn't be able to record it in the first place. Albeit, I didn't do that much of it. I only did about four events worth, I think. I'll have to have a little keek. Which is, uh, now, in fact. Ah, there it is. Halloween comeback. Super ghouls and pumpkins. The seeds of adventure. Yeah, about four events. Huh, I was right. Okay, so time for the preludes. Of course, subsequent episodes will ha feature actual combat map gameplay, though. So don't you worry about that. Although all you really missed out were some mooks, but I digress, let's read this out. We've finally made it here, me. Are you ready for this? Also, is my makeup on right? Of course, me. We'll defeat the witch and take back Castle Cassage. And of course, my makeup's perfect. It's me we're talking about. Yup, by the way, why are there two of us? Well, it doesn't really matter. You get used to it. It's fate. If you ask me, by splitting into two, our idol coefficient's gone up several thousand times. Not double. Not triple, no, 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 just several thousand times. Even my idol frenemy got a bright costume, so... That's right, if there are two of her, there should be two of me. Exactly, smart thinking me. And now, the most important thing, without a doubt, is... My new performance. Oh, what grand reveal may this be? Heartbreak Castle Cassette, Heaven and Hell, Duel Concert, Sweet Bloody Halloween Special, What the It's So Sweet, That's a Mouthful and a Half, Missy! Holy moly! It's about to begin! <laughs> Ticket sales are projected to completely sell out. I had to reserve some tickets for Chaldea. Wait, people are actually attending your concert? As such, I can't let the schedule get messed up now, can I? Which is why I need to take back the castle, me. Okay, let's go. Ready, set, go. Excuse me, princess. Who's making all that noise? It's the middle of the night. Why can't you be quiet? Hmm. Why if it isn't two ugly little girls? Rude. Oh, you little shrimp aren't very fashionable at all. What a sin it is to be like you. Look who's talking, Messi. And I am disgusted. Disgusted. You cling to the glories of the past. You're so focused on something that you'll fail to see the bigger picture. Yet, I will accept that my glory must have blinded you. So sorry. Huh? Oh, uh, no, but thank you. Humph! Don't get the wrong idea. It's not like I was trying to be consider or anything when I said that. Now get back to your dank little caves, you scrawny lizards. Because, as you're quite well aware, staying out late is very bad for the skin. Duh. She gives us such a powerful aura just by standing there. Her idol coefficient is really high like always. Jeez, I understand why I was shaking the presence of a powerful enemy, but for now, just concentrate. I know that. Now get ready, witch. You make me laugh. I've never got myself ready for anything because... Hair flick, are you just naturally beautiful? Because my heart is free as a feather. I have no worries about anything. 
Ugh. This self-confidence and boastful attitude. She reminds me of someone. Hmm. She's like a woman I see every single morning when I'm checking myself in the mirror. And obviously, the word witch is inappropriate for me. Witch in this region refers to not to an embodiment of beauty such as me, but rather to that Halloween girl next to you, right? This is just a stage outfit based on the concept of a witch. I'm the mistress of this castle. <laughs> you may not look that great, but you've got a real sense of humor. It's tasteless, low class, and ridiculous. What did you say? <laughs> if you tell me that the job of a castle mistress entails wearing a ridiculous outfit like that, even I can't help but laugh. It was just in the spirit of Halloween, you know, the prior Halloween event. Actually, I'm tired from laughing so much. I'm going to bed. I'm the owner of this castle now. Naturally, I am also assuming direct control of these lands as well. Being a ruler is much too difficult for try-hard lizards like the two of you. Now be good little commoners and quietly take your leave. Okay, I agree with you that times. Elizabeth is a bit try-hard with her performances, but she tries. She tries oh so hard. Ha 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 ha, but I don't know if freeloading nobles like you can handle the life of a commoner. What? What did you say? Don't scream at me. It's like listening to surround sound. Well, yeah, there's two of them. Shut up! You took my castle cassette without asking. You're not even from the right culture anyway. Yeah, you're like Egyptian, right? You don't match Castle Kazetch at all. Hmm, are you so excited that you haven't even bothered to look outside? Ha ha ha, it's too late. Behold the snake that foretells the end. Huh? Something weird sticking out? You just ruined the castle with a pyramid! And you dare talk about fashion and beauty? Oh, you're back! Good evening! You do know I'm actually really busy. You know, caving in your castle and all. What is that? Why is my castle a pyramid? Actually, why is the pyramid upside down? The castle's all smooched. All you did was stack on top. Talk about cutting corners. And breaking them. Ha 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 ha. You've got me there, little lizards. But I'll tell you one thing. This is remodeling. Farewell to that nasty, disgusting prison castle. What this era wants is simplicity. The golden ratio is the basis of beauty in this world. That's right. Just like me. Exactly like me. No, it probably looks out of place. I mean, this is Europe. Besides, how's that remodeling? Avant-garde, Hakon, Art Park, Museum. Anyway, this castle's under my control, but I understand beauty. I'm not a monster. If you insist on holding a concert out of respect for the former owners, I will offer you a place. Oh, how nice of you. Yes, I know exactly where. How about that stable? Okay, you could have just offered up a room. The castle as big as is, you know? That's rock and roll style right there. You could jam in the same kind of place that holy man was born in. <laughs> what? Well, it was Christmas, right? Ha ha ha! It's fine, it's fine. No need to thank me with words. Just bow down before me in gratitude. Hell no! Hump. The negotiations failed, huh? How disappointing. I guess I have no choice then. Behold my power! It's what I'd like to say, but fighting directly isn't elegant. It's bad for my skin too. Besides, you gotta roll for me in the gacha. So I'll leave that to my stand-in. Fierce, ugly knight of steel, come forth! Tristan the Tragic has arrived. What? As has Lancelot the Sorrowful. No way! 
Now then, I have to get back to my book. Finish them by the time I'm done, you losers. Of course, if you fail, you're banished. I have no use for men whose only redeeming quality is their beauty. How sad. You're underestimating our power, aren't you? I agree with Tristan. We'll have this finished before you can read the next sentence. Now then, it's time for you to go. Hey, time out! We're here to fight with that nasty woman over there! A truly good mistress has talented retainers. <laughs> I'm so perfect. You have such a big head, don't you? Oh, I'll give you one last bit of advice. Remember this face, for it is my consolation for you. After all, they say saying beautiful things makes you more beautiful, right? Why you? Let's do this, me! What? Fanya? Now go! We were told to take your lives. You cannot beat us, let alone our mistress. You need to grow at least ten years older. Cute little girls. Wow, we lost a couple of literal homewreckers. We'll get you for this, you cougar lover. We'll be back real soon. Ha 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 ha. I look forward to it. Now, let's go, Law Tristan. Homewreckers. He's generally shocked that she called him that. I would be too. I'm just acting as her guard! <laughs> Panting? We made it out okay somehow, but... What do we do, me? We can't hold our concert at this rate. I hate to say it, but we can't handle this on our own. Uncle Vlad is away on business. Yeah, he's kind of at my party. And Tao Cat said, Woof, I'm leaving on a journey for Paws Unknown and quit her job. By the way, do you think she was lying about why she would quit? Were we tricked? It doesn't matter. No, I mean, it does matter, but... Wah! If only my puppy were here! No sense in complaining about what we can't have. Ugh, I'm so pathetic relying on others and whatnot. Humph! So what, me? Do you have any good ideas? No, but... Then stop complaining. What? You don't have any ideas either, do you? You're stupid, so just shut up! Ugh, you're me, so you're stupid too! I'm a caster, which makes me one rank higher than you in intelligence! Is that how it works? There is no such stat! And you know what? I'm not sure it's a good idea for caster me to be one rank lower in MP either! Oof! Yeah, you know that's a sore spot for me! What, you wanna fight? Curse words! More curse words! Huh? Huh? What's this light? Huh? Huh? What? Wait! What happened? Huh? What is this? Halloween comeback! Super ghouls and pumpkins! The seeds of adventure! Oh wow, that went quite quickly? Right, so... Section 1, I suppose... BAM! Super ghouls and pumpkins! The seeds of adventure! I forgot to mention Halloween comeback! Section 1, the power of friendship! Okay, let's start the briefing. Doctor, you seem more excited than usual. Did something good happen? Hmm. Anyway, let's start the briefing. What's the matter, Roman? I know it's been a year since we've last spoke this way, but... You can always tell me. What? Aren't I always like this? <laughs> or maybe it's because I've been staying up late lately. Doctor, sorry I haven't been able to help you out even though we're in such a tense situation. Fu? Now Fu's looking at the doctor suspiciously. 
Is there something you're hiding from us? Actually, why is the staff surrounding us right now? Well, a minor singularity has been detected, see? Obviously, we can't just leave it there. I would like you to investigate and correct it. So, like what we always do? Yes, Master and I are all ready to go. Now, I don't think anything will hinder this mission, but... The briefing's over, so you need to head over there now! Wait, Doctor, you still haven't told us where we're ray shifting to! Oh, someone dropped some documents here. This won't do at all. Um, your ray shift destination. Um, how do you read this again? Uh, I think it was... Castle Cassetch. Yeah, that's it, got it! Time to head out! Fair? Doctor, did you just mention that one castle name we could ever just let slide? I want to go back there, though! I need to see the number one item! These choices are both mean! The Nightmare Resides! Oh, that's right! It's almost Halloween! It was supposed to be a cordial gathering, but last year's dev concert is still haunting us! I loved it! <laughs> Senpai, it's too dangerous! That music will destroy your psyche if you continuously listen to it! That's not going to work! Oh, staff! Scrum! Do you mean scram? Once we save the world, I'll personally review your current salary! Do we even get paid? It's time to show them the muscle you've gained from training with Leonidas! That's not fair, Doctor! FAIL! Let's do it! Crouch! Fight! Set! Force them in! Yeah! Why, yeah? We'll come and haunt you! So the doctor is the final boss! Oh, I love these choices. I'm picking the first one, though. Fine! When you do, I'll welcome you with some pumpkin dishes! In any event, head out! Go, uh, keep Elizabeth company again this year. Meaning, just go to her concert, okay? Nothing makes an idol like her sadder than an empty venue. And you should make idols cry! Yeah, I'll even give you some of my glow sticks. Now then, commence forced ray shift! You say forced. I say I wanted it. <laughs> well, yeah. now I'm depressed. Nah, I ain't no Debbie Downer. Uh. Yes, the ray shift succeeded. Looks like Fu is here too. As per usual. Fu! Communication seemed fine. Doctor, the ray shift succeeded. However, we won't let this slide. I kind of hope that you will. Anyway, how are things looking over there? Uh, all dim and gloom. It looks like a graveyard. We can get back at the doctor later. Let's keep moving for now. Huh? Sorry, Master. If I remember correctly, last year when we came here, there were ghosts all over the forest. We're in a graveyard, but I don't see any ghosts. I wonder what's going on. Hmm, I'm getting a reaction of some kind. It's very close to you. Fair! Hmm, bugs. Completely unrelated to Halloween, but a nuisance nonetheless. But let's take them out. Phew, the battle is over. Everything has been annihilated, so it should be safe. Shall we head into town, Master? Although I'm pretty sure servants are going to show up and get in our way. So our reward is box seats at the concert. This sucks! I like the reward. Master, don't be discouraged. It'll be fine. I'll be with you. We are what is Master and Servants! Looks like a remote. Slurring me words. Looks like a remote way to continue the mission. Thank goodness. Now, let's head towards town. Oh. Fu? Fu, what's wrong? Could it be? Run! We're just going to start running? Wait, Master? Master? 
got a bail. Achoo! Hey, it looks like my stealth race shift worked. <laughs> Be afraid. Be very afraid. Achoo! It's so cold. I didn't know the mountains in the west were this cold. That's a problem. I guess I'm dressed a little bit too light. Oh, and now it's time for section two. Boop. Halloween comeback, super ghouls and pumpkins, the seeds of adventure. I almost learned to get on section two, the hero, and we gallies. <laughs> gallies? Turbo reading is hard. That's strange. The town doesn't feel like Halloween at all. Still, it doesn't seem like it was attacked or anything either. And all the house lights are on, but I don't see any townspeople walking around. Actually, Bash? Yes, hmm? Up in the sky? Yeah, look above you. There's a castle in the sky. Um, what? Castle Kasetch! What a mess! And on top there's a pyramid, and it's upside down! It's just sitting there, Senpai, like... BOOM! Foo? I checked it out. The pyramid and the castle are from different epochs. Oh, of course they are! The former is obviously older, and the fact that it's crushing the castle like that means... It's not her! Right, I've never heard of her having anything to do with pyramids. Of course she doesn't! She's Hungarian! <laughs> what should we do, Master? Head up there? Let's gather intel first. We should head for a tavern. Get some booze, drink our woes away. I'd be, I'd be fine with that. I see. People let their guard down when there's alcohol around. They're more likely to talk, even with newcomers like us. All right, let's go! Welcome! Um... My, my, such young customers. Welcome to Matahari's Tavern. Your one-stop shop for bittersweet meetings and farewells. Are you seeking traveling companions? Companions? No, we're fine. Oh, is that so? Then perhaps that cute guy with you came to find some other kind of companionship. Oh, my. I wouldn't mind spending the night with you, you know. Sure. No, we're fine. Right, Senpai? Right, what? What? Fine. <laughs> False choice it is. That's too bad. Actually, we'd like to ask about that pyramid. Oh, yes, the pyramid. It fell from the sky one day. It really was sudden. Inside, you'll find a queen and the loyal knights who serve her. They banned Halloween. Can you believe it? Oh yeah, we could just skip on to Christmas, right? <laughs> banned Halloween? There was a notice from the queen. If you object to the way I rule, if you're a reckless savage that dreams of getting rich fast, come and challenge this pyramid. Seems like a pretty sweet deal. So she has declared. And so this town is searching for heroes to do just that, to take on Pyramid Kasetch. Oh, do it! I'm going to get rich off the Pyramid's treasure! Leave the defending to me, you guys! We did a match! I'm a priest that only knows how to heal using mundane means! Hey, leave any doors or chests to me! So many people from so many different lands. I see. No wonder it's so lively. Ah! There she is! Side, please take me home. Gladly! Uh... Master? Acts like you don't notice. We're going to leave nice and quiet. Where's my third hidden option? I would take her home, warm her up with a nice hot cuppa, and actually put some clothes on the pair last. <laughs> but oh well, that's not a choice. So, uh, act like you don't notice, I suppose. They're both pretty mean, regardless. 
Starry eyed? Master, it's too late. She's noticed us. She's positively glowing. Puppy, hey there. Hey. Uh, let's make a run for a master. Wait, hey, wait. She's chasing after us. Also, I think I just saw a familiar face. Maybe that was just my imagination, but we don't have time for that. Wait! Master, master. It was basic survival instinct that made us flee, but maybe we should at least listen to what she has to say! Yeah, it's bound to be one of the causes of the singularity, after all. Sorry, I could just help it! Flash is right! Ah! No, I get it. Our feet just started moving off their own accords. You made me fall over. That hurt. Don't leave me behind. Oh! <laughs> Master, I hear crying from behind us. Goodbye, eardrums. Hello, Halloween. Okay, let's head back. What do you want? I have a broken heart, you know. Oh, puppy! Oh, come on, so you did hear me. Also, you need to sort of the uh, other side of your battle bikini, little missy, because it's kind of hanging. <laughs> I'm not happy about this at all. You made me so worried. You should be punished. Is that you, Elizabeth? Have you forgotten? It's me. The Celebrated Diva, praised as a town that only comes once every thousand years. An unbridled genius. Elizabeth the Crimson Hero, with a tire base up of Dragon Quest. Fibba! Where's Lancer, Beth, and Castelli? A swimsuit? At this time of year? Yeah, the summer fits already passed. It came with it, my broken heart, because the gacha was cruel to me. <laughs> That's right, the swimsuit event is over, Elizabeth. What? Wait, you had a swimsuit event without me? Where was my invite? That's not fair! That's not fair at all! Well, let's forget about that for now. Let's not! I want to know precisely why no one called me! Because you're taking over Halloween! I see. So two Elizabeths were driven out of Castle Cassage by this queen. Yeah, exactly. Now do you understand? The one cast duo couldn't finish what they started, so now there's something I must do for their sake. In other words, once more. That's right. That cursed pyramid has destroyed my concert hall. I'm going to take it out and overthrow the queen within. This is the mission of the Crimson Hero Elizabeth. So that's what's going to happen this time. An RPG adventure! I'm down for it. Yes, I see. That's why there are tons of adventurers in the tavern. And there she is! Surround her! Huh? Oh, what's going on? This is... Elizabeth, who are these people? The Queen's lackeys! Be careful, they're all pretty strong! We are knights in the Queen's service. We fight to purge Halloween. Those who speak of our, our desire to bring back Halloween shall be exiled or sentenced to hard labor, without exception. That's terrible. And we also received a complaint that this girl over here is um, not wearing appropriate attire in public. It's just her Halloween costume is okay. Fair. That's not true. I'm quite obviously dressed as a hero. Wait, I am right? Uh, if you were a Dragon Quest, sure. Uh, um, in any event, it's exile or hard labor. You're gonna have to pick one. I don't have to be afraid of you any longer. Come, puppy, we're going to fight. Wait, can you always tell us why Halloween was banned? Because, uh, because the queen ordered it, silly. Then we'd like to ask the Queen why. The world's most lovely Queen will not hold an audience with the likes of you. Sorry, but we're going to restrain you. Like how you are. If you're going to stand in the way of my concerts and everything I stand for, I don't care who you are. I'll use every ounce of my strength to defeat you. Looks like there's no way around it. Let's go, Master. 
By the way, do you keep seeing someone working around here? Hmm, I wonder. A yellow apparition, perhaps? <laughs> we failed! Retreat! Retreat! We sent them running, but they were all quite skilled. Yeah, so skilled that they lasted about... A loading screen transition's worth of time? <laughs> a queen adored by knights of such caliber. I wonder what she's like. We'll probably need to meet her if we're going to repair the singularity. Now, puppy, you're going to help me, right? Dave has joined the party! The thank goodness. Thank you. I'm so moved. I want to dance and sing right at this moment. Not necessary. Let's move. Eh, fast much? Whatever. Anyway, the legend of the Crimson Hero Elizabeth is going to start right here. That witch needs to brace herself. Crimson Hero Elizabeth's adventure has begun. So, why were you in the tavern with that sign? Oh, that all you did was say this to the owner, lady. Oh, no. Now then, I'm looking for some strong, radiant companions. One who will put me in the spotlight and worship me. I'll be on vocals. I've never been in a band before. Looking for pros on guitar, bass, and drums. <laughs> when I did, she smiled and just handed the sign to me. Isn't that mean? You presented yourself in a very interesting way, Liz. I guess it serves you right. <laughs> Your Majesty, we have confirmed visitors from Chaldea. It seems they were caught in the bounty field that was put up. Uh... Ha! Oh, I'm so perfect! I predicted all of this! I, of course, have countermeasures in place! With the ultimate gatekeeper on watch, my superiority cannot be challenged! Oh, it's too beautiful! I rule this land appropriately, with tolerance and ruthlessness. If I may, your majesty, well how we continue to be bad? Don't! How about going to a salon and cleaning up your dull work first? It's too soon for the common fools to celebrate Halloween. Holding such a light-hearted festival when the world is in such an unstable state, pure idiocy. Endure with patience, and keep love within your heart. Follow in my footsteps. But everyone was looking forward to Halloween. My children too. Blasphemy, back talk is punishable by death. But for the sake of your children, I shall give you a day off with remuneration. Lay down your sword and return to your pitiful family at once. That is, if you value your life. What kind of threat is this? Uh, your majesty. I, uh, I don't quite follow. Just go home. It means you have tomorrow off. Understood. Though with all due respect, I shall receive your punishment of... Paid leave? Now then, my queen, what would you have us do? Shall we take them on now so we don't have to worry about them later? Ha 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 ha! Merry Christmas! I mean, you fool! If we did that, it'd be like... I was afraid of them for some reason. I'm sending the knights into town. It'll prevent the citizens from becoming restless. As for you two, well, there's no need for you to be deployed. I know you're planning on hitting on the local girls the second I send you there. Sorry, but things don't always go your way. No, that's the lie. Unbelievable. She sees for our very way of life. No, Lord Tristan, I really just care about the safety of the town. I hear there's a girl with a broken heart at one of the taverns. Apparently her man left her after losing his entire fortune on a bet the other day. Which tavern is that? You mean that cute girl from Ash Tree Tavern on 3rd? Oh ho ho. Maybe you'd like to wait in prison instead of your own rooms. Excuse us. We will, we will remain on standby, your majesty. And then we shall take our leave. Please get some rest, my queen. I will, of course. Now leave immediately. I just had to have a wee town shift in between. <laughs> uh, yes, your majesty. Tristan?
Huh? Uh. <laughs> oh, sad. This intense pain is making me sad. You know, in a way, that was quite impressive. <laughs> okay, last section. For now, Halloween comebacks, super ghouls, and pumpkins in the seats of adventure. Section 3, making. Nailed it that time. <laughs> first things first, we should get more people. Are we not enough on our own? No, that's not it. Mash, Poppy, I'm always depending on you. But we're up against famous knights. Just the three of us isn't enough. You what? Also, I'm a fantasy hero. They always have a wide variety of party members to support them. When I was an idol, I had someone on drums and taiko, woodwind, and more, all to back me up. Where were they? And who were they? We need more cowbell. I know, but I think there's an even more pressing issue at hand. Um, so you'd like a caster as well? Yep, yep, and a cleric type would be good too. One who can use their cure magic for healing. Healing, huh? Now then, let's begin the treatment. This is to save you. You will have to endure one or two broken bones, maybe, and maybe the loss of an arm or two, or three. Okay, here I go! Yeah, not that one. Hmm? Healing? You don't need that yet. We can self heal through adrenaline and endorphins alone. Come now, don't cry. Pull yourself together. You're a hero, right? I don't really know what I'm doing, so I'm going to take you apart. I'll do my best. Yeah, none of those free options. Let's handle the healing ourselves. Good idea! Finding the right person for the job is harder than I thought. Is there anyone else who can heal? It's no use. Nobody comes to mind. How about we head back to the tavern and ask there? Uh, I'm not sure about the tavern. I suppose you're right. In that case, doctor! Uh, hey! Oike oike! Uh, talk about ominous voice! I had a rare occasion to relax and I couldn't resist. Don't worry, I've confirmed your location. What's going on? We want to find a servant that can join us, so we'd like you to widen the search range as much as possible. Okay, roger that. It's like, but there's a signature near you. What? Near us? Master, be careful. Someone might be here to ambush us. Huh? What? Is someone here? Show yourself! You fool! Or nobody can appear. It's quiet. Doctor, are you sure? Of course I am. I'm doing my job. I really am. But if it's that close and you can't tell, then that means... An assassin, I imagine. They haven't moved at all, so I'm guessing they don't mean you any harm. Ah! Master, that scream! Who set this trap here? My leg's stuck and I can't move! <laughs> Something weird's coming! I can't move! Save me, puppy! What a hero you are! Let's go save her! More like the damsel in distress! Yes! Elizabeth! Puppy! My leg! It's stuck! I can't move! Save me! It's okay, we're coming. Master, give me your orders. Save me before you do that! Sorry, in a second! The battle is over. In a second? Good work. I'm not seeing any more enemies in the surrounding area. Except for the KO to Demi Dragon in front of you, I mean. What? Okay, Doctor, so. <laughs> the constant flame must have made all her blood rush to her head and knocked her out. I suppose we should get her down. Yeah! Could a 
have done it sooner! That was mean. You just left me there. Sorry, we had to prioritize the situation. You could have used the sharp end of your shield to lop the rope off. <laughs> Preferably not a leg, though. In any event, there isn't anyone here. I'll turn you into a pincushion for lying to me. That's strange. Looks like they just won't come out. It's almost like they're saying, I want nothing to do with this zero who's mistaken herself for a hero. I'm going to stay in my room. We'll just have to bring them out somehow. Oh. Boo! Master, you like you just saw the world ending or something. Your spiritual essence is also wavering. Are you okay, Dave? Well, what's wrong, puppy? You don't look so well. Do you want to hear a song? Will you feel better if you hear me sing? But what's up if that's... I just might! Whoa! What did you say? The... The could be! Dave, this is all my fault! You must have been carrying around a heavy mental burden all this time! I'll ray shift you back and we can try the singularity and get later. No, it's okay! I swear! I'm fine! Master, put yourself together. Um, well, you can do it. You can do it. No, oh, let me listen to this. Phil, Phil, Phil. Puppy, you have finally become captivated by my songs. Very well. This will double as my daily voice training. I'll sing my heart out for you. Consider yourself lucky. You're going to be the first ones who get to hear my songs after becoming a hero. I wonder if a flock of wyverns will randomly come to attack. If not... Robin soldiers will suffice. Honestly, anything's fine. Whoops, guess not. It's too late. Hold it right there. Oh. Phil. Thank goodness. Huh? Uh, it's the green, you know, uh, man. Robin Hood? Yeah, that's it. <laughs> Damn it. I had to release my dull face making. Dave, you're reckless. Huh? Huh? Wait, what's going on? Huh? Master risked that all to bring the hidden servant out. I don't really get it, but this is all thanks to my song, right? I'm just glad I was able to help Puppy. Yeah. Boo. If it's going to weigh on your conscience later, then don't bother doing it at all. Oh. Elizabeth? I get it. That trap that got me a moment ago. That was your doing, wasn't it? What a pain. You have surprisingly good intuition. Yeah, yeah, sorry about that. The outskirts of town have been dangerous lately. Pests and werebeasts have been lurking about. Probably because it's almost Halloween. The monsters are getting all excited too. There's a guy who roasts... Ro roasts? <laughs> he roasts around these parts with all the charcoal in hand. No. There's a guy who roasts around these parts. I can't sleep at night without setting up some drops. I get all anxious. Are you sure that's the werebeast's fault? Is it not just that you need traps around to feel at ease? The latter, of course. A free safe haven doesn't feel right. Safety is maintained through hard work and money. You're pretty cautious. Yep, I'm a cautious boy. Only the humble survive in the forest. I'm naturally a coward. To save me fre frenemies. <laughs> me enemies face straight up. <laughs> Is that why you take them down from the shadows? You're actually an assassin, aren't you? It does seem that is unusually dangerous here. I bet that pyramid is the main culprit. That's right, Mash. Nicely done. That pyramid is the cause of everything. I'm sure something could be done if we travel there. You think so? To be honest, the werebeast started showing up way before the pyramids. <laughs> hey, looks like someone else got caught in the drop. If you're going to take on the pyramid, I don't mind looting a hunt. That queen's brazen attitude is just too much for me. I was just thinking that she could use a little punishment. Thank you very much. Elizabeth, we got ourselves a scout. Scout? You mean someone who looks for potential idols? But I don't feel like joining an agency yet. What should I do? Considering you're a ruler, I really think you should stop daydreaming like that, you know? Sh shut up! Anyway, let's take out those werebeasts! Puppy, Mash, Robin, follow me! I can't have dirty werebeasts attacking my town! Uh... Robin, what's wrong? Oh, nothing. Just think about how the apple doesn't fall far from the tree, so to speak. 
That dragon girl has no other plan but to Roshun. We'll just have to support her, won't we? Hey, it's a fuzzy wuzzy. Well, there you are. <laughs> Something really did get caught. You look stupid hanging upside down like that, pot kettle. Boo! Elizabeth, you should think about what happened to you a few minutes ago. I decided to stay positive and keep anything that happened in the past locked away in my heart. Well, how about you examine some of those things tucked away in your heart, huh? Yeah, I couldn't forget them even if I wanted to. Anyway, Green, you're joining us once we take them out. Sure, once we get rid of all of them. There's no reason for me to stay in this forest anyway. This is totally going to be a pain, but I guess I have to. I'll join you on your death tour. It's not a death tour, it's a curing shiny concert tour. Cure, tour, cure, fur, <laughs> the cure. All right, the scout would have scout for us. You're going to keep your promise, right? Fine. So what do we do? Barge into the pyramid now? No, I want one more person, I think. A four-person party is pretty standard. RPG mechanics, oh, wait, sex! Anyway, puppy, I want a mage. Oh, uh, you're going to go scout a mage, huh? Well, that's fine. I do know someone, but, um... Is there a problem? Is it because they have gone insane, or that they built miniature gardens? Or that they're fighting between AC and DC? Or that they fought a summon a flying saucer? Well, those would be problems, yeah? It's just, she's a lot like someone we know. A lot like who? Point silently. Me? <gasps> I just had a feeling of impending disaster! But he who runs in the face of the enemy does not deserve the mantle of Pharaoh. No matter what disaster it may be, I shall humbly fight it off. Alrighty! That's that wee lengthy reading session over and done with. Holy moly, it was quite an enjoyable read though, but I'm more so looking forward to actually properly partaking in the event once again because seeing it for the first time is different than, of course, rereading it, even though I did skim past it before because I generally just save the full reading session for the room once I'm normally done with an event, but. I didn't go too gung-ho on this event this time. But anyway, folks, thank y'all for watching this wee episode of Fake Grand Order, and I'll see y'all next time. Ta-ta for now.